Hello everyone. Uh, you know, I got the man of the moment with me. Uh, the guy who did something which uh, you know for me would be one of my one of my fondest memories of my cricketing career. Mr. Kohli, what's happening? Please tell me how did you do this, bro? How how? This was something which was I don't think logo इतने सारे साल cricket खेला है लेकिन I think ये जो special moment था. Please describe to all of them what how did you manage to do it? Thanks, Ash. Firstly, uh, we had a great partnership. Uh, there was a lot of pressure. When Hardik came to play, we were in a very difficult position. To be honest, I was feeling a lot of pressure because I had played a lot of these games before, and I understand, you know, the expectations and the magnitude of the game. But he was very fearless in that partnership. When batting came, I had Hardik immediately. He kept telling me, you know, let's talk, let's communicate, and we'll look to just bat deep partnership. We'll make it. You know, anything can happen. So. He really kept me um, focused at that point because at that time we were talking that you know I, I wanted to hit a few big shots, which could have been risky because we looked at four wickets out there at the tenth over mark. Spoke to Rahul Bhai about the same thing, but uh, yeah, we just kept batting. I just don't know what happened when we got to the hundred partnership. We just came on the board. We were just focused on yeah, when which shot to hit. You know, just getting the right boundaries at the right time, and then um, end me. We spoke about the fact that Nawaz has one over left, and Hardik was backing himself to hit three, four sixes in his one over for sure. And then we figured out that these people actually want to end it at the end, and they want to kill the game first. That's when I told him, if we can go after Rof, then the game will be completely set for us. They will panic, and that's exactly what happened uh, when he got hit for a couple of shots. That's when. I'm sorry I to interrupt. I think. I I can't explain you. I was I have been part of. I said I I I try to be. I mean I I try to be very calm and all that. And those two shots because I knew how important those two shots are. Yeah. Just let let's be very honest. If this those two shots, even if you have missed one, still they were running uh, ahead of us. And I don't think man, the kind of shots I'm telling you, I was very closely and it, I have hit a lot of sixes, but th those were like special, special, really special in my heart now because. What meant for both of us? We actually were so pumped, uh, and yeah, uh, that I think those two shots. If I told him, I said, I said, I have played this cricket. I mean, played cricket so much, but I don't think those two shots. Any anyone, would, no one would have played except the Kohli, Mr. Kohli, and um, yeah. I, I mean, the best part about what I loved about him was that we struggled. Yeah. You know why it was so special was that we struggled together. Um, um, It, it, this would have been not this special if we would have just walked, you know, just to cruise through. Yeah. You would have played some ex exceptional shots. I would have done. This was more because this feels more special because we knew we struggled. We were talking to each other, realize how difficult. And credit to them as well, the way they bowled. You know, they bowled yeah. fantastic. Yeah. And uh, uh, yeah, I mean, him being on the last, key, uh, Mr. Uh, what do you call king and chasing and. Just one more, a little feather, uh, feather in his uh, armory or whatever you call. I might be saying the wrong sentence, but if people got the emotions in the. No, but I wanted to ask you uh, when you came out to play. We were four down, and uh, you were still very positive, even though we were taking a bit of time. You were still very positive. When dot balls are hit, then you were saying that our partnership will not end. Slowly, slowly, anything can happen. So, what were you thinking in the dugout when you were walking out? Very honestly. Uh, To be very honest, when uh, you know, I, I I sense a lot of pressure in in Apna group. Me, I was I could sense it that people are and I'm I'm with with all due respect, obviously a lot of people and big game and how important it is. We all have worked very hard as a collective group. People are happy for each other. So, uh, but for me somehow I don't. I was just very numb today. Even when I came on the ground, um, I was just happy. I was speaking to Rahul sir as well initially. He came. I think I think I I won't say he was the tense, but he told me you know. You know, you have done a lot of good things. Just be calm and all. I had to tell him that, sir. Please understand. I'm happy to be here. Ten months back, I was working in my space. I had no idea. This is where I wanted to be. And I said, irrelevant of the result, what happens. Uh, I'm just happy to be here, playing with all the all the best cricketers in the world. And my, they are my brothers. Everyone is there. I, the, the the amount of uh, the the quality of relationship which I have in this group is something which I cherish and I always cherish. So when I was coming inside. Uh, for me, it was you were the see. I, I I did not. I would have taken my for example. I would have taken a bullet for you that point of time, but I would have not let you get out that point of time. So my goal was simple: that 
whatever I can make uh, your life easy. Uh, your life has to be easy there because you have done this over the years, crucial games, and no one is better at uh, you know handling pressure than you. That so for me it was honestly I was just numb and I just wanted to play and I did not wanted both of us to get out. Though we had some really good players who can come in and still help us out to win the game, which they eventually did. But for me, it was important that you and me stay. I believe that we could do it, even when three or forty needed. Even when we were missing the ball, I knew that yeah. one of us will pull off something special, and yeah, you, yeah, you just keep the show away, which is which is which is something which is very fantastic. It is uh, one of the most memorable nights uh, of my life for sure. Played for fifteen years. I, I don't think I've ever <laughs> experienced uh, emotions like this. The last yeah. time I experienced something like this was against Australia in Mohali. I was a bit emotional then, but right now I'm, I'm numb. Maybe because that was more like a semi-final for us, like a quarter-final. But here is the first game, so as happy as we are and as emotional as we are, uh, the adrenaline is high. It will take a bit of time to sink in, but we understand as professionals, it's just one game. One year. It's just the first game, and why it's so special is because from the situation we were in, yes. to be able to get these two points to get the tournament off for us is very, very crucial. Because 2020 cricket, especially the World Cup. We've seen in the Asia Cup, if you fall behind once, then it's very difficult to catch up. So starting right is very important and this has given tremendous belief to us and we'll just have a smile on our face and enjoy ourselves this whole world.